Thermite is a pyrotechnic composition, usually consisting of a metal powder and a metal oxide. It creates extremely high temperatures in a very small area for a short period of time. I show how to make thermite using aluminum powder and iron oxide. The temperatures can be as high as 4,500 degrees Fahrenheit. Thermite is used for welding, metal cutting, science demonstrations, high temperature ignition, disabling military equipment, and other applications. Aluminum powder and iron oxide can be bought or homemade. Iron oxide can be made by leaving pieces of iron such as nails in water for a few weeks and filtering the solution. Then it's ground into a powder. It can also be made through electrolysis or with a strong oxidizer like bleach. Aluminum powder can be made by tearing up aluminum foil and grinding up in a coffee grinder or leaving shavings in a ball mill. It may take some experimentation to find what ratio works best for you. This is because the concentration and size of the powders will vary. I'm using the basic 3 to 1 ratio with 3 parts iron oxide and 1 part aluminum. I measure out 27 grams of iron oxide. Then I measure out 9 grams of aluminum powder. Mix the powders together until the color is consistent throughout. The finer the powders and the better they're mixed, the easier it will be to ignite and the faster the reaction will be. You can use sparklers or magnesium ribbon as a fuse. If you have trouble igniting your thermite, try mixing some magnesium powder or chips into a small amount. A simple container to fill the thermite can be a pop can or a flower pot. I fill the thermite into the container. Start your thermite experiments with a small amount at first until you understand how it behaves and if the ratio needs to be adjusted. 